Hello guys and welcome to today's video. So I just saw on Instagram that a track that I've been waiting for for a long time just got released. And it's a new single from Traders and the song is called Dwell. So I've been actively following this band for a very long time and I follow their struggles, I follow their hardships and I really look up to the content they create. I find Tyler Shelton to be a very fun and inspiring person. So I've heard him talk about this single that they're about to put out a few weeks back and how he thinks that this is the most heavy stuff they've ever done. So first of all, I'm very, very excited for the next album that they're gonna release because I thought that the last one was amazing. And secondly, I'm very excited to hear this single that you've been talking about. This is one of the most hard-hitting bands that I know. And I hope I'm not overhyping this, but I do expect a lot from this. And I'm hoping it's very heavy. So without any further ado guys, let's just get into this and I'll tell you what I think along the way. This is, uh, as I expected, the, it's, it's not too uncommon for them to play this distorted intro and then repeat the same thing coming after but with the real sound, with the full sound. That whole thing is like a building a lot and that makes the whole drop or when the music actually comes into picture makes it really really heavy and like full of effect. What an extremely heavy and like s dirty guitar sound this is. I'm not sure what drop they play. Even if it's obviously very dropped, you can still hear the tone of the guitar, which is really important when you're gonna drop the guitar that low. And I think we're about to go off here. Oh, switching the pace. I'm liking where this is going. Very nice and heavy two-step part without making it too hardcore. They still have this like pumping element of the metal still in it. And some of the screams he did during the last heavy part was like Tyler Shelton is such a, an amazing vocalist. He has this element to his voice that is like full of frustration and anger and there's no one else that can sound like Tyler Shelton. He has this own little under pitch in his, vo in his vocals that is so crazy. Good. You cannot copy this guy. He's fucking amazing that way. That makes a lot of other stuff so full of angst and just pain. It's beautiful to listen to. Let's get back to the two step here. I'm sure there's a big drop about to happen. The way the bass lays there. Nice break.
I just have to say this before the drop comes. He's chosen to go way more brutal way with his vocals now, with a lot of more like pig squeal influences. Extremely slimy gutturals. I really like that he uses his dynamics here because he is so talented. Let's go. When those double pedals come in like that, it's still like slow, because the riff is so slow, but it makes it, oh my god, it makes it so good. I really love that part. So guys, what can I say about this? One of the most heavy stuff I've heard in a long time. Since that's what I come to traders to listen to, it's just perfect. So even though I hyped it up a lot, I did not get disappointed. There was a lot of elements of this song that was really, really nice. That are kind of traders stepping out of their comfort zone, maybe? Maybe not comfort zone, but where they usually sound like. And inserting some new stuff that they haven't done before. For example, that super slow part where he really goes off on his gutter rolls and kind of pig squeals it. I really like that. And also the double pedal part where I commented that it started like pedaling slow but still like double pedaling during the very heavy part. As well as then doubling up that double pedal right after that. So altogether, this was heavy as shit. I can't wait for the whole album. If it's gonna sound like this, it's gonna be amazing. I'll link the original video down below so you can go check it out. Big ups for traders. All my best to you guys. Hope you enjoy watching this video. What did you think? Comment down below. Have a sunny fucking day.